Qualitative data collection is the most important pattern but is often unused, underused, or misunderstood. Welcome to today's session, exploring qualitative data collection and analysis. Our agenda is packed with insightful topics aimed at enhancing your understanding. Let's dive in. First, we'll outline lesson goals, setting a clear direction for our discussion. Next, we'll introduce qualitative data and insights, laying the foundation for our exploration. We'll then examine current approaches to data collection, highlighting their strengths and limitations. Following this, we'll unveil a new, innovative approach that promises to revolutionize how we gather and interpret data. To illustrate these concepts, we'll walk through practical examples of data collection methods, showcasing their effectiveness in real-world scenarios. Additionally, we'll explore cutting-edge techniques in data collection, pushing the boundaries of traditional methods. Finally, we'll delve into feedback analytics, demonstrating how valuable insights can be extracted from various sources of feedback. By the end of this session, you'll have a comprehensive understanding of qualitative data collection and analysis, equipped with the knowledge to implement innovative approaches in your own work. Let's embark on this journey together. Qualitative data is a powerful tool that enables us to crack the mysteries behind human behavior and experiences. Unlike quantitative data, which focuses on numbers and measurements, qualitative data delves into the why and how of phenomena. It allows us to capture the intricacies and nuances of human experiences through meticulous observation and analysis. By diving deep into qualitative data, we understand the underlying motivations, emotions, and contexts that shape human actions. This depth of insight is invaluable for making informed decisions and developing a deeper comprehension of complex issues. Whether exploring customer preferences, understanding employee motivations, or unraveling societal trends, qualitative data provides a rich tapestry of information that quantitative measures alone cannot capture. Qualitative insight guides us toward meaningful understanding and impactful decision-making in today's rapidly evolving world, where human behavior is increasingly complex and multifaceted. Now, let's shift our focus to the current qualitative data collection and analysis methods. Traditional techniques like interviews and ethnographic studies offer valuable insights but also come with challenges like researcher bias and time-consuming analysis. In today's digital era, navigating vast amounts of qualitative data poses additional hurdles. Overcoming these challenges is crucial as we explore innovative approaches for more efficient and reliable insights. Now, let's delve into the primary approaches used in qualitative data collection today. Firstly, we have transcripts from interviews and focus groups, which provide rich, first-hand insights into participants' perspectives. Secondly, data from various online sources offer a wealth of unfiltered information, revealing trends and sentiments across diverse platforms. Lastly, open-ended survey data allow respondents to express their thoughts freely, offering valuable qualitative data alongside quantitative metrics. Understanding and leveraging these diverse forms of qualitative data is essential for gaining comprehensive insights into complex phenomena. Collecting and analyzing qualitative data today involves a complex, multi-step process many organizations navigate by hiring external researchers or evaluators. These experts design tailored data collection strategies, often relying on enumerators to conduct detailed one-on-one -on -one interviews. These interviews, rich in nuanced insights, are then transcribed into text, a step that is labor-intensive and critical for maintaining data fidelity. The subsequent analysis phase is where the real challenge lies. Researchers use advanced tools like NVivo to look at the textual data, identifying patterns and themes that are not immediately apparent. This stage requires technical proficiency with the software and a deeply analytical mindset to interpret the data meaningfully. The culmination of this process is the preparation of a comprehensive report. This report must articulate the findings clearly and concisely, making them accessible to stakeholders and situating them within the broader research context. Crafting such a report demands a high level of academic and practical expertise, ensuring that the insights of the qualitative data are robust and actionable. The current process of handling qualitative data is intricate, requiring a blend of specialized skills at every step. From the meticulous collection of data to its detailed analysis and the final reporting, each phase poses its own challenges. Despite these hurdles, the depth and richness of insights that qualitative research offers make it an invaluable tool in understanding complex issues, providing a level of detail and context that quantitative data alone cannot achieve. 
Qualitative research is inherently time-consuming, requiring skilled professionals to conduct and analyze interviews and focus groups thoroughly. This process often demands significant investment, either for training existing staff or hiring experts, to ensure the data's depth and accuracy are fully leveraged. Yet, the subjective nature of this research introduces a high risk of bias stemming from improperly framed questions, selective data sampling, or the inclination to prioritize data that confirms pre-existing beliefs. Crafting unbiased, effective questions is a nuanced art, essential to avoid leading participants towards predetermined answers, which can significantly distort the research outcomes. The challenge extends to the analysis phase, where the temptation to select snippets of data that resonate with the researcher's expectations can undermine the study's objectivity. Achieving a balance between comprehensive data analysis and maintaining an unbiased perspective is crucial, necessitating rigorous methodologies and a commitment to objective research practices. The transformative shift in data collection hinges on using open-ended questions and the innovative patterns we'll explore in upcoming sessions. Although not a novel concept, many organizations have underutilized open-ended questions, often subjected to only a superficial review rather than an in-depth analysis. This oversight has largely been due to the absence of modern feedback analytics platforms tailored to the nuanced needs of these organizations. Historically, lacking specialized platforms meant that deep, analytical review of open-ended responses was challenging, if not impossible. While emerging platforms like Qualtrics Experiment Management, XM, offer advanced capabilities, their high-cost and general-purpose design do not fully align with the specific requirements of social-purpose organizations. There is an option, too, where you can get comprehensive, quick, and pre-post insight in three simple steps. So, do not shy away from leveraging the power of open-ended questions for meaningful insights. Transitioning to the current state of qualitative data analysis, QDA, software and the associated limitations. While existing software offers valuable tools for organizing and analyzing qualitative data, they often come with constraints. These include steep learning curves, limited flexibility in accommodating diverse data types, and the need for manual coding and interpretation, which can be time-consuming and prone to errors. Moving forward, let's explore the landscape of existing qualitative data analysis, QDA, software, particularly focusing on AI tools for sentiment analysis. While these tools offer some level of automation and efficiency, they often fail to deliver comprehensive insights. They are time-consuming and limited. Despite their capability to generate sentiment analysis, these tools are limited in their ability to provide deep, nuanced insights. They may offer surface-level interpretations without delving into the underlying context or complexities of the data. As a result, users may lack the depth of understanding needed for informed decision-making. In the next session, we will talk about the game-changing data collection and feedback analytics. We will focus on new qualitative data collection and analytics approaches. Stay tuned. Do you know there is a solution to help you save a ton of hours doing qualitative data analysis and you can use it right now? Simply go to sense.sawpack.com and get started. Don't forget to like this video if you found this video informative and engaging and subscribe to our channel for more video like this.